Hello there beautiful people and welcome back again to OnHow channel. For people that don't know, my name is Enes, I'm working for you. So if you have any questions and video requests, make sure to drop one below in a comment and I will be happy to make a video for you. And for people that do know, welcome back. Please bear witness for that because I made over 200 videos on Shopify customizations. They were mostly requested by you guys, I mean subscribers. And I know actually some people not even subscribers but I'm fine with that. I still make the video for them. So don't hesitate, if you have any video requests or any questions, just drop me a comment below, I would be happy to provide you the information you need or even make a video for you. And yeah, you don't have to subscribe or maybe now you should consider subscribing because if you don't, you lose. Why is that? Because this is a very different chapter on this channel. I usually back in the past, I share small customizations on each video, but now I will be sharing complete sections, highly customizable to make your Shopify store very professional without having to pay for those expensive teams or hiring those expensive developers or even worse, paying those monthly subscription applications that will drain your money and not a very good idea for long-term project as well. Or I'll give you a better deal, scroll down to the channel, check out the videos and the sections I'm sharing lately and I'll let you decide and I'll respect your decision. But in this video, I will show you something very unique and completely free again, which is urgency hot selling product widget on the product page for your Shopify store and it looks very good, it's interactive and it has a fire icon or actually let me shut up and show you how it looks like. So as you can see by the way this is Shopify down team so I always start with completely new team, nothing on it and each video has add small customizations by the video like 70 or 60 the team will be completely different. But right now, because this is a different chapter, I think I'll reach that level by the 20 or 30. And to give you an example, you see this section right here, which is a review section that will show reviews from multiple sources all in one place, including Google, Facebook, Amazon, and Etsy, all in one carousel. And you can filter through them. If I click on Google, it will only show me the reviews from Google and so on from Facebook or Amazon and Etsy. Or this a recent sales uh, notification, as you can see, that shows up, like you can control the behavior on it. Come on, show up. Here it is, as you can see, you can control the behavior for it, how long it show up and when should show up and for who should show up. And yeah, this is by using your own custom code, no applications involved and many, many more interesting stuff coming in the future. But I'm about to show you in this video. Let me scroll down to access some product from here. And yeah, all these sections I scrolled through, all I did in videos and by using your own section, no applications involved. So let me access this product, for example. And here is, check it out. This one right here completely free without using any application by using your own custom code. And this is how it looks like and it plays a huge role in scarcity techniques that you can make the like, customer like uh, feeling like he's missing out or something like that. And I know many applications actually have this offered for a certain price and so on. So this it will not like uh, start moving like this. It will only move once in stock product left in stock are below five. Let me reload the page because I'm, I'm sure this will be yeah, for example, as you can see, now it's 11 products in stock. It will not have that animation of jumping around, as you can see. And also, you have this tilt effect, as you can see, if I move the cursor from corner to corner, it has this tilt effect, which is a 3D effect. And this is very, very unique. I never saw any Shopify store that looks exactly like this. There is other widgets that do the same job, but not quietly like this. Let me reload the page. Maybe it will change the stock below five. Come on, come on, do it for the last time, one last time. And by the way, you can control the stock number. So it will show uh, by default between five and 20. You can control that number. You can lower the number. It will show only between five and 10. And that will give you more chance of having the customer actually visit the, co the product page and it will show him like five or less products and will still have the anim animation again. And it's very easy to do so. Even if you're confused, just drop me a comment. I will be happy to help you out. But for now, let me quit talking and show you how to add actually this on your product page. So the first thing you're going to do is access Shopify dashboard. And if you are already in Shopify dashboard, click on online store, then click on teams, then click on the customize button right here. You might be thinking, oh, this is already available. No, it's not, it's custom code. So uh, the next thing you're going to do, we need to access the product page. So in here it says uh, home page, click on it, then select products, then select the default template that you set for the product page. In my case is the default product one. So I'm gonna click on it. Let me switch to a cleaner product. This one has more information. Uh, let me switch to this one, which is the one I used demonstration. Oh yeah, by the way, the other ones, I already add them in videos and completely free. Make sure to check out the channel for the million time again. So the next thing you're going to do after you access the product page on the team editor, click here on the product information on the left panel, as you can see, click below the last one and you see add block, click on add block, then search for custom and it will show you custom liquid, as you can see. Click on it, then it will show you uh, a prompt on the right panel this time where you can paste in some code. 
and in here we're gonna pass in the code and where are you gonna get that code you need to hire a developer pay him with 24 hours i'm just joking scroll down the description box and you will see a link my website click on it then download the file then click on then open the file sorry with any text editor on your computer and simply copy the whole code inside it then paste it in here that's very simple right after that we're gonna click on save button it already it's, as you can see it's already here then let me drag it up because that's not where I want it to be so let me drag it below I think below the trust badges yeah now it's perfect I have too many things here but this is just for demonstration let me click on the save button we'll get back and it's already here because I already removed it uh, the power of video editing it's eight let me reload the page one time one time here it is if it's below five product accent stock it will show the animation like this as you can see if you want a widget that actually automatically detects how many products in stock i already made a video for it make sure to check it out but for now i think my job is done thanks for watching catch you on the next one